Muffin Builder version 3 comes with the updated text editor, also known as the column item. Please know that this is not a visual editor. For those who do not fancy writing simple HTML or using short codes, please use the visual editor item, also available in the Muffin Builder. Besides the new excellent design, the editor also comes with tons of handy features. We've also moved all of the settings to a new tab. You'll find it in the top right corner. This makes the text area much bigger and more accessible to create content. Now you can add media directly without going to the media library for the URL. It will add a ready image tag, including the source and other useful attributes. The next cool feature is the shortcode manager. Let's say we want to add a button. Now you do not get a long and hard to fill shortcode, but a simple visual representation of it. Using the interface, you can populate all of the fields, add an icon, change the colors with a color picker, and much more. Once you are finished, click on Add Shortcode. Great! The filled shortcode is ready to use. You can still modify it manually, but if you hover over it, you'll see a small menu with Edit and Remove icons. If you click the Edit icon, you'll go back to the visual interface. Awesome! What if you want to add text or a heading? The Format drop-down is where you should look. It contains basic text formatting tags, like headings, paragraphs, and even a code tag. On top of that, we've added syntax highlighting and error correction capability. The errors appear on the left side, and if you hover over them, they'll tell you how to fix each mistake. You also have the standard styling options at your disposal. That includes bold, italic, underline, font color with a color picker, and lists. You can also change your text to a link, insert a line break, create a table with this cool-looking new interface, add dividers, and even generate random text strings in lorem ipsum. The generator can add standard text as well as lists. Finally, we can see the back and forward arrows handy if you remove something by accident. And this is all for this video. We hope you'll check out the new column item inside the Muffin Builder version 3 and have a great time using it. Thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and click the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. If you have more questions, visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.